here we are, Technique Tip, right. Owen Flanagan. Just the tip. Welcome back, good to see you. And special guest, oh, Christian Osbeck. Good to see you. What do we work on today? All right, we're gonna do an entry to K-Guy using the Choi Bar. So, a lot of the time I park the circles around to North South, okay? And you can be framing here and trying to get their legs and stuff, or trying to basically get your foot hobbled back to the inside of this here arm. Okay, and once you get that foot in, you can basically safely use both of your hands to try and counter attack. So I'm gonna ideally just connect my hands on my partner's arm, bring my shin in front of my partner's face, so I'm able to pressure down on his head whilst pulling down on his arm, and that allows me to swing my foot over and through. So you can either choose to step on the hip and try and pull your partner's arm out, but for example, if you tried that, so I've tried to step on his hip, I tried to pull it out, and then he hands his arm underneath. Okay, and I've already shot my leg through. Now it's gonna be kind of difficult to pull this arm out. Okay, so as my partner's pulling out and holding inside his leg, I'm gonna underhook his leg, frame on his armpit, and bring my foot to his armpit. Okay, so your foot that would have been here over in a half guard, or just like loose in the air, frame and bring your foot to the inside. So now your partner can't basically drop their hips on you, and I'm gonna be able to connect to my hands, and if they try and keep this knee on the floor, I can just pull and kick with my hands, with my leg at the same time, and pull the knee to my chest. So from here, there's a lot of things that could happen, but for the most part, people backstep pretty quickly as you throw this leg over the top. Okay, so I'm gonna follow the leg and shorten my grip to the end of the heel so they're not able to like continue turning and ripping. Then from here, I'm gonna pass off the heel to my opposite hand, bring my armpit over the top, and then aim to catch the heel, putting as much weight on it as possible, pinching down with the top knee, trapping the toes properly. The heel can be in the bicep, that's fine, as long as you have a good grip. I'm gonna pinch down, look over my left shoulder, and it's not the pull to get the finish. All right, one more time. So, can you guys hit the knee? Try to camp at the J point with framing. As long as you get this foot in front, I can now commit two hands because he won't be able to circle. So in general, I'm going to punch this hand under his face and get in this gap, then connect my hands and bring my knee, if it's not already in front of his face, bring it in front of his face. From here, I'm going to push his head down with my knee to try and swoop my foot over the top and onto his hip. Let's say I manage to pull his arm open and get my foot through, and then he manages to hold on the inside of his knee again. Okay, now it's gonna be hard to switch to Kimura and stuff and extract the arm without him ripping out. So if I try to go Kimura here, because I don't have tension, he can rip out. That's when I'm gonna go underhook on the leg, frame, and bring my foot in place. So you need to win that here, bring your foot in place, and then you're good. It's gonna be hard for him to defend his K-bar entry. So kick and pull, pull the knee to your chest. Now from here, I'm throwing my left leg over the top and catching, so you've got to be tight here with your hamstrings. I'm gonna slide my hand down and connect to the toes. So I'm basically like a, a toe grip holding your own, your own shoulder here so they can't turn too much and run away. Most of the time people are gonna to manage to cross their legs here, but let's just assume that we manage to get a good catch on the heel. So try and trap the toes as much as you can between your tricep and your lat. So here, heel can go there, then you can finish basically pinch down with your top knee, look over your shoulder, start to hamstring toe, and you get the finish. Very nice, fellas. 